Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial. Okay, so today I'll be showing a basic SolidWorks uh, tutorial and let's start with part. Okay, let's give it a few seconds to load up. Uh, perfect, it loads up. Now, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna click on my uh, front plane. Okay, click on the front plane and I set up to normal to. Okay, so I click here. Perfect. Now I'm going to enable the sketch. Okay, now I'm in the sketching environment here. Let's try to do sketch now. And let's start off with our uh, center rectangle. Okay. And guys, please note that this should be MMGS, okay, right here. If it's something else, please change it to MMGS, okay, before you set any dimensions. Okay, let me, okay, I accidentally clicked here, so I'm just going to press escape. Okay, perfect. After pressing the escape, it disappeared, which I wanted it to. I'm going to come here, I'm going to select the smart dimension tool. And I'm gonna start the dimensioning this rectangle. Okay, this should be four. Okay, and this should be four as well. Perfect. As you guys can see, it's uh, completely black. This means it's fully defined, which I wanted it to be. Okay. I'm gonna set up another rectangle right inside. Okay, let's just zoom in so it's easier to work around. And I'm gonna use this origin point. Okay. And I'm gonna set up the rectangle somewhere here. Yeah. Okay. And inside, and this rectangle, the inside one, is supposed to be construction. Okay because we are going to be using for construction purposes and let's define the dimensions of the rectangle this should be 3 and oh perfect and this automatically comes as 3 which is fine okay. now what I'm going to do I'm gonna make the circles, the four circles over here on the corners. Okay. Over here. Right now it really doesn't matter what size they are because I'm gonna give this I'm gonna click on the smart dimension and I'm gonna give them the dimensions. Okay, four circles already. And I believe the circle is going to be Uh, this circle is going to be 0.26 in dimension. Okay. 0.26 enter. Okay. 0.26 equal. 0.26. Enter point two point two six. Okay, so that's one way to make all the circles point two six, right? But I also have another way, which I'll be showing you guys in a minute. Let me delete this. Let me delete this. Let me delete this. Okay. Okay, so I'm just gonna undo, 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 undo. Okay, perfect. Let me just change this dimension to 
0.26 okay so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna select the circle okay and I'm gonna select this circle I'm gonna select this circle and this circle now I'm gonna press this equal to sign okay so now all of these circles have a relationship which is equal okay the all these circles gonna be equal to this main circle over here okay so if I were to change something in here it will also change in here okay that's why uh, I use the equal sign so because all these gonna be equal which I need it to be okay let's move on to the second step I'm gonna click OK in the property sign property and let's start off with the center uh, circle okay so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna make the construction circle okay and this circle has to be 1.625 so I'm just gonna make a circle click on for construction okay and give the smart dimension okay 1.625 okay it actually rounds up to 63 which I don't want so I believe you guys might be having the same problem so I'm just gonna come here on the settings and in the search I'm gonna write uh, DIM which is short form of dimension as well so click on the property uh, document properties a uh, draft drafting standard dimension click on here get to this page and primary precision right here where it said primary precision you want to change it to uh dot one two three not dot one two okay click okay and there you go now this thing is point two six two six two uh six two five which i wanted it to be okay now i'm gonna uh create four circles around it okay so uncheck that click on the circle and the way I know the sketch entity are enabled that it turns gray after I click once so it's me now I'm able to draw a circle okay and once I hover my mouse over on the circle okay as you guys can see that a little uh, yellow dot on the uh, four dots will, uh, will uh, pop up and you just click on one of them over here and then draw a circle this pretty simple and there you go set the smart dimension of this circle is going to be uh, 0 0.19 point 19 enter and I'm going to select this circle first let me okay okay let me press escape first so everything get uh, come to normal by pressing escape I'm gonna uh, press and hold control the key on your keyboard control key okay I'm gonna click this circle then I'm gonna click this circle and this circle and this circle as you guys can uh as you guys uh as i told you guys that i'm going to be holding the control key that's how you select all the circles okay now i'm going to hit the relationship over here on our left side said uh add relation i said equal to perfect and i click ok once i click ok it's done now I need to uh, make another circle right in the middle okay this is gonna be a solid circle I'm gonna come here big circle click on this origin point and then make the circle and the size the dimension of the circle is one enter 
perfect and now I'm gonna uh, try to clean up my drawing okay all these extra lines over here the construction lines I'm gonna erase them by using the trim feature okay Right now, all I'm doing is trying to make my drawing clear. Look at this, should be done. Better. So basically my drawing is done and in the description below I'll try to give you guys the link of the drawing where you guys can see and follow the drawing okay hope you guys like my tutorials and if you guys like please give it a thumbs up and hope to see you guys next time in the next tutorial take care bye